Mini Matters, a miniature and painting podcast. Okay, so, well, okay, go on with me. Um, this is just you filming yourself, obviously, uh, opening your first painting that you've ever bought for a lot of money from um, Jeff Taylor. Uh, I'm not sure why I wanted to film it, I just wanted to film it and um, maybe relive the opening of the painting. Basically, I saw it online, and as with most Warhammer things, I look and I go, holy crap, and I probably overspend on things because I'm so worried someone else will pick it up. But the thought with this was, um, what was the thought with this? That's it, it's an original. So all the models I've got, um, I've obviously, I've obviously bought, uh, but, and some of them are like super, well, some of them are hard to find us. <clears throat> I've only ever seen them on sale the time I bought them, which does make them rare, but this is the original painting from Jeff Taylor of the second edition Elder Codex. Um, and I sort of thought, you know what, I'll just sell as much as I can because the models I can probably get again, maybe, or more likely at least, than you can an original, you can only ever get one, right? So that was your thought process. I mean, you know that, but you might forget. Or, as with most things, you do forget. Uh, so, he, Jeff, said that it would be safe to cut, but I'm still a bit worried. I mean, and also, he said that this is, is canvas. In my head, canvas was a lot, uh, was, is a lot bigger. Um, it's like a, it's the white thing, isn't it? On wood. I'm assuming this is all safe. Anyway, I did spend a lot of money on the painting. Um, what did I sell? I sold, a, I sold quite a few things. Um, hmm, maybe more than I paid. Some of the stuff I sold for cheaper. I tend to sp spend a lot of money on on things that are damn cool. But what this could be is he could have just paid and it could all be elaborate hoax because I had to pay, um, he made me pay via bank transfer directly. So there's no, um, there's literally, it's just trust. That was all I had. <sighs> you just had to trust him. Ooh. Okay, that's quite nice. There's a little, I've seen these. Smart. So, there's a letter. I, <laughs> I can't imagine it's an actual. Okay, it is just a letter. I've seen, I've seen these before. Um, I can just zoom in, can't I? Where did I see this? Hmm. Maybe it was on his website. But they're, um... Well, a bookmark, there you go. And then the certificate, which he told me he would get signed by him. I also found out that Jeff did, um, he did a whole load of the Lord of the Rings paintings that I really liked. I had no idea that he did those. Um, but I was damn impressed. Anyway, here we go. Like, do you keep the original box for when you move and you need to transport all this stuff again? I mean, how do you trans... Oh, I'm going to have to get this insured as well. But I do believe I've not been scammed. So apparently there are only 20 of these. Apparently.
This is the card. The damn good painter. He's a good kid, even though he's older than me. So now I'm going to have to take this to obviously a framing shop, aren't I? Wow. It's bigger than I imagined. Not allowed to show people without Games Workshop's permission. Well, there you go. That's me opening it. Now I need to put it there. Oh, I've got that as well, that's cool. Well done. 